Good morning. Today we are going to island hopping excursion. Finally, this is what El Nido is all about. We were supposed to meet at nine, but they called us that we have to be there earlier because the pickup is earlier than expected. So we're rushing right now. We're rushing, rushing. Here we are, first for this tour. I don't know what to expect. I did not do any type of research on this. I let Yanni do this, so we'll see. Uh, we have to use them. Okay, where? Ask him, please. Where are they? We're buying last minute aqua shoes because I asked a tour guide and he said it's recommended to have aqua shoes because one of the stops is really rocky. Try Bunny quickly. Then we can switch later. It's so flat too. Because I don't know if this will fit you, yeah. Oh, that's perfect. Is it nice? Oh. Do you want to just wear them now? And just carry the sandals on your bag? Oh, yes, okay, yeah, please. Thank you. Your boss. Okay, we got Fabius Aqua shoes. Now we have to rent our snorkeling gear. We are rushing because <laughs> they told us nine, but and now we lost our group. I don't know where we are, but we got our snorkeling. Sir, are you going to go? Huh? Hi, Asa, thank you. Asa, my group is Nathan Gabriel Karamblu. Asa, Aga to? Asa, Oh. Stress. No idea, guys. Obviously, the second, everything the second. Our language is the crew here in the boat. So start in our captain. Captain will say good morning, my boy. And our crew here, Kuya Emil. Hi, Kuya Emil. Kuya Emil. Hi, Kuya Emil, my boy. And uh, Kuya. I love that our people in the RK boat. At the back. And Kuya. So this boat's not better, okay? So rule number two during swimming and snorkeling. We're vlogging each other, I love that. <laughs> let's do this, let's vlog each other. First island. I don't know if you can hear me because it's very windy. We'll try and yell. But it's the first stop here. We have 40 minutes here to swim. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh my god. Oh my god. The view. Like I was speechless. Speechless. Mesmerized. Mesmerized. <laughs> Hey guys, we're here kayaking. <laughs> so nice. Oh my god, look at this. Wow. Go so bunny. Wild. I'm taking, taking a picture. picture. I am taking a picture. <sighs> oh my god, you guys. This is insane. 
This is beautiful. Nothing, nothing can beat Philippines. We've been everywhere in the world. Not really, but like, Philippines is number one. Say something. Sorry. Oh, sorry. 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 You too. We almost bombed. <laughs> Guys, the waters are so clear and calm. And it's crystal. It's beautiful. It's pure. Oh my gosh. The snorkeling was amazing, the coral, the colors. Unfortunately, the videos didn't turn out very good because I was in charge of it. <laughs> but, right. you know, I did what I could. And there was a sea turtle, but I couldn't see it. And I'm so sad about it because you guys know by now, that's my life dream. Turtle! Guys, we just saw a viewer. <laughs> She's one of the canoe, in the, one of those canoe. We and it's... Well, actually, we did bump into her, literally, <laughs> quite literally. It's just a, what a weird place, what an interesting place to see a viewer. We're loving this, you guys. This is amazing. Wow, Philippines is crazy. Wow. Philippines is crazy. So, honestly, it's the most beautiful place I've ever seen in my whole life. I'm not even joking. Fabio said I could just keep on vlogging and he can, he can keep on paddling. Perfect. <laughs> paddle, paddle. Let's go. Anything want you want to remove. say to the vlog? I want to remove my glasses, actually. Why? Because I want to see it with my eyes. I know, I was thinking about it too. Guys, are you loving it? Yeah. Let me do vertical. Bob, you dropped his glasses, but it's okay. Oopsie. I will. Oopsie. I took my glasses off because I wanted to see pure beauty, and well, wasn't that a mistake? Never. It's alright. Never again. Oh, what a show. oh, that's okay. It was meant to be, to let it go. I had those glasses for nine years. Nine years. Oh well, oh, well let it go. For my whole life. They're just things. We don't need them. Shit. Shit, for real. What a dangerous act. Wow, we can even just like chill here and just like take in the moment. Oh my God, this is crazy beautiful. What the heck? Wow, look at that. We cannot, we, cannot, we cannot stop saying wow, guys. Like, bear with us. Wow, wow, wow. How are you feeling, driver? <laughs> Hi, driver. I'm just working on my core. <laughs> well, you always like to go to the gym, so this is your workout today. Oh my gosh, this is so beautiful. I'm just vlogging because our viewers want one hour vlog. <laughs> That's what you're gonna get, no complaints. I don't know how we're gonna make a one hour vlog. Guys, how is this, how is this even possible? Like, wow. Oh my god, it's so peaceful. I feel like we're entering a dimension. Me too. Oh my gosh. I just got goosebumps. Hi nature, we're here respectfully. We love you. We mean no harm. Thank you for having us. Thank you for sharing your space, not me being a yoga teacher. Wow, what a peaceful life. Oh my God. How do you feel? It's magical, isn't it? Oh my gosh. Let's take a selfie here. There was a, li a little portion of it, like a little lagoon that felt like going into a different dimension, like Jurassic Park. Everything got quiet. The water changed color. There was sound of nature everywhere. It was like, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. Was it. Crazy. it was so weird. It was crazy. Guys, my hair is double weed. Literally. Help. Send help, please. Mm. Bye. Bye. 
baby must have drank some Drop that. The baby fell. <laughs> Last stop, it's the secret. Last stop is the secret beach, secret island. I don't know, I, I didn't really pick it up. We'll see. Secret lagoon. Michelle. Michelle. We found Michelle here in the tour. <laughs> guys, we just finished our excursion. Hi that, guys. That was the best day ever. Oh my god. That was so nice. Magical. Super fun. Super smooth. Let's describe the thing using adjective. Magical. Th that's how you describe usually. Adjectives. Phenomenal. Oh yeah. <laughs> He's saying that I have ballet shoes on, guys. Very just 80s. <laughs> His aqua shoes are ballet shoes. We're back in the civilization. Also, they have a boat racing competition going on here in El Nido. It's so nice. The boats are so fast. Yeah, but I don't have sunglasses. He lost it in the lagoon. He dropped them. We're not returning this snorkel because we no longer need it for now. For now. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. This too. Thank yeah. you. Your name was Yanni. Yeah, thank you so thank much. You. Thank you. Thanks. My, my souvenirs. Souvenirs again. Look at that bracelet. Everything is so cool actually. Okay. We just got back to our Airbnb. Freshly, Freshly showered. showered. Oldly shower. Me later. I'll shower later before bed because we're gonna go out and it's gonna be dusty again. Because you see the road. Again. We wanna take this opportunity to update you all what happened today. It was gorgeous, guys. It was so gorgeous. I was like, I wasn't sure because I said, oh, we did something similar in Vietnam and that was a bomb. My that God. was very unique. And it was. And it was. It was unique. It was very different than what we did here. Even though the landscape was similar, but I Nothing know. really. It's not similar because no. this one is an island. It might be limestoney, but like the, it's island. You get white sand. Vietnam, you don't get any. You don't get that. There's no white sand um, in Vietnam. But but it was still gorgeous. Um, here it was so magical, beautiful. But which one's your which one's your favorite part? Um, my favorite was the snorkeling for sure. It was beautiful the snorkeling. Oh I was like in my element. I was swimming around, minding my own business. It was just amazing. Um, I think my favorite was the kayak, oh, the, kayak the lagoon too. kayak Sorry. and the snorkeling the second. Snorkeling so, was beautiful. Kayak was not my favorite just because I lost my sunglasses. <laughs> but my fault, like nobody else's fault but mine. Beautiful, what are we doing today now? Now we're gonna find strong Wi-Fi because we need to work. Like you guys think we're here around and hopping island to island but we actually we got some need work online. <laughs> work done and yeah. I want fresh juice because I need to hydrate this crumpsty crumpling skin we've been dehydrated all day with the sun <laughs> so that was really beautiful you guys check if, out the sunburn <laughs> oh my god if you guys didn't know we did tour a so when you come to Olido, tour a is the best apparently and second is tour c i don't know if we have time or money to do tour c we maybe will we'll pass that. tour c i'm telling you now but we did tour a it was amazing so today let's go grab something refreshments so we found a coffee shop we're just gonna work a little bit Setting up, bunny. <laughs> hey guys. We also got brownie. Hey guys, so we did a lot of work, uh, lots of emails, lots of editing. I took time to read all your comments. We love your and comments. I am gonna tell you, mark my words, I'm gonna reply one by one. One I by one. I swear to you. Connection is terrible, so I'm gonna wait for a better time, but. Just so you know, I got you guys. I read a comment that says that I don't need to love all the Filipino food. And I'm telling you guys, my reaction is really honest and genuine. Things I don't like, I will tell you. Such as Balut. One thing about Fabio is, he is genuine, honest, and he is never fake. Awesome. Whatever, whatever he thinks, Kind, he says gorgeous. it. Shut the fuck up. 
Okay, so now we are off to dinner because we got hungry. We're craving the pad thai. We saw like a pad thai restaurant, um, the food truck. So we might go check it out. El Nido has a lot of food. They even have Indian food over there. So we <laughs> said we said we're gonna go to food truck, but we changed our mind because it's so pricey. El Nido is actually expensive. So instead of paying that much money, we might as well go back to the first night we had dinner and where, have an extra course. Yeah, that's what we're doing. Yeah, and Fabio, where Fabio got adobong posit. So we're gonna try obviously something else. I don't know what I can try actually because I remember uh, fish options were not that many. <laughs> Okay, let's see what Fabio's gonna get this time. Mm. Thanks to everyone who are concerned about our food poisoning journey. Fortunately, we haven't had food poisoning yet because we have been so careful. Oh my gosh, you have no idea how careful. After that experience in Mexico and Costa Rica, never again. We brush our teeth with bottled water. We wash our toothbrush with bottled water. Yeah, nothing touches the top. We also shower with bottled water. <laughs> It would be nice though. Um, but yeah, we've been very careful. And as you can see, we've been eating quite good. And good. Uh, I'm taking probiotics, but no other He's taking probiotics, yeah. Uh, Fortunately, been... nothing. But we did see it because every time we wash our hands in the faucet, the water, the water is sometimes is yellow. yellow. Yeah. So, yeah. I did not notice that in Mexico. We are do we were we are saying this because we were just reading your comments again. We love reading your comments. Please keep commenting. <laughs> we got calamari. Look how fried it is. <laughs> Welcome to Fabio Eats. Welcome to Fabio Eats. That's a new <laughs> thing in this channel. Oh the crisp. For our second dish, we got escabeche. How do you say it? Escabeche. Nice. Look. Oh, it smells so weird, good, guys. Fabio tried it. If you saw the vlog, I think day four, Fabio tried this at my friend's house. And she cooked it for us, which was so special. Welcome back to Fabio Eats. Welcome back to Fabio Eats. <laughs> <laughs> so, Fabio tried this cabbage at my friend's, and that was really delicious. So, that was his base. So, now he's gonna try this. There's a lot of sauce, which I'm obsessed because I got garlic rice. So, I'm gonna dip it into it. Um, Yami taught me a very interesting technique last time on how to open a fish uh, which is just basically destroying it from the middle. It's not destroying it. It's like it's stabbing it. It's like, like yeah, because you can drag it. You can drag the meat, see? And drag see? it out. See? Because the, the, the drag bone is in the middle. Out. See, there you go. The meat is there. There, try that. Again, he's eating with a fork instead of the spoon. But and I'm trying to scoop up the sauce into With the, the fork. Bowl. See how stupid like white people are? Like, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You, you don't want no idea. you don't want rice with it. Yes. Garlic fried rice. Just a little bit because I want to try the, the flavor. The fish okay, let's see. They said when you like it, your your eyes li lights up. Go. Ready? <laughs> light up your eyes. Your eyes didn't light up. <laughs> it is delicious. The sauce is exactly like what. Your friend did. Exactly. It's very similar at least. Nice. It's so, it's sweet. It's, a, there's a little bit of a spice to it. Yeah. Which I'm not sure where it comes from. Yeah. It's very nice. It's sweet and sour, right? Kind yeah. of thing and spicy. Is there cumin in it? What is it? I don't know. You like it? Guys, I need to know how to make this sauce. Please comment below. Let me know the recipe because it's so Oh, delicious. in Italy. Let's recreate it in, in Italy, Italy. We're going to recreate this for my family, maybe. Yeah, we're going to make them try it. One thing about me and Fabio is I know how to eat the fish, every single corner of the fish. But Fabio didn't know that this part is also meat. This part is also meat. I would have totally left it. <laughs> this part is also meat. And even the head is also meat. 
This is I'm me. definitely not. That's just me being Filipino. I was taught to eat it thoroughly. Look at the meat. This is meat. Oh. oh. Is, is, is cabiche your one of your fil favorite Filipino dishes? Mm -hmm. yeah. So you have scabiche, adobong posit. Um. Yes, scabiche. I think this is my very favorite so far. Scabiche. But the second one with caramelized onion. You remember milk fish? Oh, bangus. My god, that was good, guys. Sizzling bangus. Or the fried or the sizzling. Sizzling bangus, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. That makes seafood one. That, that is also Filipino. It's like sizzling, sizzling plate okay. seafood. Then that's my favorite. It's also that's Filipino, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're gonna go back to your country because there's a lot of people saying that Filipino food is really not it. But Filipino food is amazing. Filipino food is amazing. They just don't know what to order. Yanni honestly never cooked for me this type of food. <laughs> so all I knew Bitch. was... Um, because it's hard to cook fish. Yeah, because the... Yeah, whatever. I'll try. We'll try this in Italy. We'll make this at home. Welcome back to Fabio Eats because as soon as I walked out of the restaurant, I had a craving for a chocolate milk. And, uh, you know, walked into a couple of stores, finally found one, and apparently, Mu is the most popular one here. And who told you that? Uh, the bitch told me. Oh, who's the bitch? <laughs> the cameraman told me about this. Um, I and this see. is fortified, so it has vitamins and all sorts of goodness. Bullshit. Now, the logo really looks Not like... Not you doing a full review of Mu. <laughs> no, because it looks like something that we have in Italy. It is chocolatey, it is sugary, it is crack. Do you feel the vitamins? I don't feel any vitamins. <laughs> I like it, it's not very milky. I wanna so try. that's the difference with the Italian one. This looks like chocolate powder mixed with water. I don't taste any milk. 